Good afternoon everybody, welcome back to another video on my Martial Arts Self Defence YouTube channel. Um, and today I'm going to be doing another improvised weapon to use. So I don't know if you can see, I've got um, a shoulder bag there. So you know when you go somewhere and you've got a shoulder bag, or if you need to have it on your back, just say if you had the shoulder bag on your back or you had it like this, like I'm doing now, you see? Just say you've been to the gym or you've been somewhere and you've got your bag on your, on your back uh, or around your shoulder. So um, I'm out somewhere as you as you are as I do. As, um, so I'll be going out somewhere, um, and uh, this this person will be acting suspicious again to me. So um, obviously I'm going to ignore it, but I'll keep my eyes on him like I do. And he starts um, saying a few things like basically like, "Oh, what the fuck are you looking at? Uh, you know, you got a problem. You got a problem, pal, or brother, or brother, or whatever they say." I'm like, no, I've got no, I've got no problem, thanks. You know, I just, I, I don't want no trouble with you. And just say that um, this is, this is where things get a bit more serious, okay? So just say if he pulls a knife out to me like that, okay? And he's like this, and then he goes, right, I want your wallet, I want your phone, I want, you know, basically whatever you've got, keys, money, whatever. And and uh, obviously I'm going to be like that and be like, no, I don't. I don't want no trouble, just back off, put the knife down please, leave me alone, you know, stuff like that. And if he's not listening to reason, I'm going to get my bag like this, like that. And now, this is what he called a shield now. So just if he, say if he, if he somehow, just to say if he, if he's not listening to reason, he fusses at me, I'm going to use this now as a shield now. So, I, so, uh, if that knife goes here, that might go through it, it might not, but obviously I'm protected, you see, so it's not going to stick that knife in me. So as soon as I've done that, and as soon as he stabs me like this, and he pulls that knife back, all I'm going to do is, is, is repeat, repeatedly attack him with this, boom, 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 like the face like this. It's completely smashing him in the face like this. This might be empty, but just say you've got your gym equipment in, if you've got, I don't know, just say if you've been to the gym, and you got some bits and bobs in there. Just say if you've been to a gym and you've been doing a bit of boxing, say, you know, you've been doing a bit of boxing or you've been doing something or you've got some, just say if you've got, or if you've got, even got some food items in here like I did yesterday with a with a tin of soup. So just say if you've got some items in here, uh, and, and obviously the bag's a bit heavy and that. So as soon as, as soon as he, like I say, as soon as he tries to stab me, that is a shield there, okay? And, uh, Nobody really teaches this. I've never really anybody see te anybody see teach this, okay? Because um, obviously with knife attacks, obviously they try and you know they try and do that or they try and do this to affect the knife or just step out of the way or they do this and they go out obviously get the person there and obviously do that with the knife and try to you know try to disarm him stuff like that. But this is a really good shield though, okay? So you use this as a shield. So as soon as he, he goes to thrust that up, I'm gonna I'll step back a little bit. Just in case he goes in, you know, quite, you know, fussing quite strong, and I do that, and as soon as he brings that knife back and goes boom, 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 and smash, completely smash him in the face with this bag, okay? And obviously that's going to knock him back. And obviously when I've done that, I could even, I could even do this, and I could even drop the bag like this, that, and go in for like that for the hits and stuff like that. But obviously I've got to be careful if he's still got that knife. If he's still got the knife, I'll continue with this. If he if he drops the knife, and obviously I can go in, you know, I can use my other things, make me you know, my strikes and stuff like that to finish him off. You know, any kind of strikes I want. So this is a really good tool. Okay. So I'll break it down to you again. So I'm here, just walking back from the gym or walking back from you know uh, the supermarket or shop or anything like that. And then obviously the person's uh, acting suspicious and he wants to he cause problems with you. Uh, and obviously, I'll tell him to back off and like, ah, oh, no, go away, leave me alone, like this, or I'm like that, leave me alone. And he pulls a knife out and he goes, to, he wants to stab me. So obviously, I'm, the first thing I do is this straight away, and I want to get the shield, shield out straight away to protect myself, okay? Because um, if without the shield, obviously, if I do this and I don't have the, have the shield, obviously, I still can defend the knife, but obviously, you, you know. Like I said to you in the other video, if I have to use a weapon, I always do use a weapon. It doesn't matter how much martial arts training I've done over the years. If I've got a weapon to protect myself, I'll use the weapon to protect myself. In all cause, you know, because say knife work is a, is a different ball game. So, so like I say, he fusses me, I do that to protect myself. 
and I'll repeatedly smash him in the face like this with this bag. Then that, so go boom, 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 boom. Now obviously I can do this, I can strike in that way, I can strike in that way, I can grab the bag like this, I can repeatedly smash him, smash him like this. If I wanted to, I can even get this and wrap it round, wrap it round his neck, and I can even sweep him down from that way as well. So you can still use this as well as a weapon as well. Not just this, but you can use this. So just say it, it, it stabbed me, and I'll just say I, I would peek his smash in his face, and obviously he's dropped the knife. So say if he's dropped the knife, right, and I'm, I'm basically smashing like this. I'll get this, get this round here, and I'll wrap it round his neck like that, and I can even pull him in for a knee. So if I wrapped it round like that and I pulled him in, I can, I can strike him out with a knee. Then as soon as I've done that, I've striked him with a knee. Obviously I've got some, an elbow strike there and I can sweep him down like that. And if he's still continue with me, I'll still keep smashing him on the floor. Boom, 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 like this. So basically it's finished. Then obviously I get the bag back on my shoulder and then obviously I walk away from the scene. So... So that's the improvised weapon for the bag, okay? But like I say, if you have to have a, use a weapon, you have to use a weapon. So, so because like I say, knife work is a very dangerous, and you know I don't want to get end up in hospital with stab wounds and somebody did that to me. So if, to say if I had my bag with me, I'd use it, and I don't give a damn. I'd use it, and that's it. Because like I say. You know, nine times out of ten, eight times out of ten, somebody stabbed you, you could end up in hospital, it could be life threatening. So, like I say, I'd use this for for a shield. No, and I won't care about anything, I'd just use it for a shield, okay? So that's the weapon, sorry, the improvised weapon for the video. Hope you all enjoyed and hope you um you practice it. Just say just practice it, just get yourself you know, everybody has a shoulder bag these days, don't they have it wrapped around the back? Just get, just get, you know, go in the mirror or in front of your phone camera like I'm doing me, and just practice. Just use that as a pat, as a shield. And obviously, when when that when that um, that knife strike comes, so yeah, obviously, in fact, I'll, in fact, I'll just show you something else. A second, hang on a second. Oh. Right, this is a real knife, okay? So I'm just just pat, I'm just showing you. Just obviously, just practice. So so just say for you, obviously, there's this. And he gets the knife and he was this and he's and he stabs me and i'm stepping back and he stabs me like that like that knife okay then obviously if, if he say if he drops the knife he drops the knife and obviously that's when i go in just repeatedly strike him and obviously and get and obviously when he, and get this to finish him off you know with it wrap it around his neck or I could even pull him i could even do this i could even like i did on the on remember that video i did before was like that i could even grab this here wrap it around his neck Obviously, strike him, push his head down, and smash him, smash his face on my knee like that. Or can even do it the other way. There, obviously, smash with the elbow, push that, push his head down, smash on his on my knee. Okay. So I thought I'd just show you with the knife, you know, just just for principle, you know, just for showing purposes, uh, for practice. So I'll well, put that back. Um, so there you go. That's the video for the uh, improvised weapon for the for the shoulder bag. Okay. So it comes very handy. And it's a very good shield to use okay so um somebody's requested about using like a rope or something but i haven't got a rope um or anything like that but that this this is uh all i can really have got is this you see my bag and, I can, and obviously this is a rope there i mean um obviously just say this is not the knife one i can do i can do another video if you want where i can just use this if you want but well, obviously if you want to jump to still do this um, but you still can use this as a weapon as well. This lot, this leather bit on your on your bag as well. Okay, you have to let me know about that. And I'll try my best for you. And that so. Okay, dokie. I'm off now. Thanks very much for watching. As always, um, like and subscribe, please. Share, comment, spread the word about my channel, please. I'm ready to add another subscribe on my channel. On my channel. Thanks very much. Thumb, big thumbs up from whoever you are to do that for me. Um, I've done. Um, I'm on. I think I'm on 88 now. So it's getting there slowly, uh, building up and building up and building up. Um, keep following me on TikTok, please, everybody. Um, like I say, there's plenty more videos to come. Um, you know, that, that one's a really good one, that improvised weapon. Um, like I said, I did the improvised one, one yesterday um, <coughs> with the, um, the cans of soup. And, and uh, obviously, 
that one with the shield will protect you from from that. So, um, just say I'll just show you just a quick one. Just say if obviously he gets that knife and he does this, and he's just stab, he, don't, he just will try to repeat to try to stab you like this. So obviously if he does, obviously I'm going to move in with him. I'm going to go like I move in with him and go, and I'll, I'll constantly keep repeating, repeat, 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 repeat until he drops that knife down. So. So just say if he does this and he does that and he keeps trying to do that to me and trying to get through the the shield, I'll just keep constantly keep repeating and repeating and repeating. But make sure you can see though. Don't keep don't if you can don't do that. So you can but try and if you can try and see like that. Or even if you step your head to the side and do it and go boom 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 like this, you can still can see what he's doing, you see. So that's just like an add-on. No. No, so um uh, Thanks as always for watching everybody, much appreciated. As I say, keep the, the followers, followers coming on TikTok please, and obviously keep the subscribers coming on my, on my YouTube channel please. Uh, oh, by the way, I've got a new YouTube channel by the way. I did it yesterday, well last night. Um, it's just a comment, it's just doing commentary about martial arts and stuff about when people's in the gym, or if, you're on, if it's self, uh, street self-defense, or it's... Um, or if it's in the ring, you know, like UFC, uh, point sparring, um, you know, competition. It's just going through different things about the videos and stuff. It's just all, it's just a commentary, that's all, nothing else. So I just commentate and just, you know, just go through different things. And, uh, and obviously people want to ask me questions. I'll do my best to help and stuff like that, okay? So cheers, as, as always. Thanks very much for watching. Hope you're having a, a lovely um, afternoon. Uh, the weather's nice here. It's nice and sunny. So, um Obviously, I've done two videos of the boxing and that, so um, with, with some music on, it's uh, giving me more motivation and that with the Rocky movie, the Rocky uh, soundtracks. I don't know if you, if you recognize them, Rocky, Rocky Four soundtracks, one of the best soundtracks ever made. Um, obviously, it gives you proper motivation when you're doing your training and stuff, so it's good and that. So, well, I've got my, I've got my um, If He Dies, He Dies t shirt on this time because it's, cause it's a bit warm here today because. Uh, you know, the sun's out and stuff for change and that. Uh, yeah, so cheers. Thanks very much. Um, keep them requests coming. I'll do my best to help you, like I said before. But like I said, if you keep doing bad uh, negative comments and that, I won't answer you. Um, and that's just the way I am. So that's it. Okay. Cheers. Bye. Thanks very much. And have a, uh, say have a lovely day. Thank you.